Agriculture is a way of life, interwoven into the rich cultural and traditional heritage for more than 70% of the populace in Telangana state. Professor Jay Shankar Telangana State Agricultural University proudly caters to the needs of the industrious and enterprising farmers in the state. Bestowed with rich natural resources, making the most of diverse climatic conditions. In the words of the Chancellor, Honorable Governor, Government of Telangana, Sri ESL Narasimhan Garu, I have always felt that the university education should be of societal relevance. Just producing graduates or postgraduates with degrees and PhDs with no relevance to society is really useless. And this university, I think, has taken up this societal responsibility in a very big way. And I must congratulate the Vice Chancellor and all of you and the faculty members for fulfilling a great societal responsibility. I am happy that this university has recognized itself to be a part of society. The youngest agricultural university in the country, established on 3rd September 2014, is unique as it strives to deliver three-pronged agricultural development in the state through integrating agriculture education, research and extension. The Honorable Vice-Chancellor with his team of deans, directors of various faculties and disciplines steers the university towards its goals. Ably guided by the Board of Management, Academic Council, and Research and Extension Advisory Council. In a short span, Professor Jay Shankar Telangana State Agricultural University has obtained accreditation from ICAR, UGC, and recognition from several national and international agricultural scientific bodies. It now ranks sixth among the farm-related universities in the country. The university's strength lies in the 738 teaching faculty and more than 1,000 non-teaching support staff who are extremely dedicated to achieving the university's vision and mission. Six agricultural colleges, one college of home science, one college of food science and technology, and one college of agricultural engineering impart quality education in the respective faculties. An additional 13 polytechnic colleges, three regional agricultural research stations, 12 agricultural research stations, eight Krishi Vigyan Kendras, nine district agricultural advisory and transfer of technology centers cater to the technical human resource demand, technology innovations, and outreach requirements of science-led agricultural growth in the state. Teaching The university offers bachelor degree programs, postgraduate degree programs and PhD programs for those interested in technical or professional careers in agriculture and allied fields. To create grassroots level paratechnical workforce, the university also offers two years diploma in agriculture, seed technology, and three years diploma in agricultural engineering. Modern amenities such as virtual classrooms, teaching methodologies integrated with advanced audiovisual gadgets and world-class laboratories with high-end technical facilities, provide an invigorating learning atmosphere to the students of all its campuses. The university maintains one of the best electronic libraries for agri-resource in the country, stocked with 2,50,000 books, 4,000 national and international journals in agriculture and related subjects. PJTSAU has forged productive linkages with leading international agricultural institutions to help students and faculty 
gain exposure to global trends and innovation in agriculture. The university lays great emphasis on the holistic development of its students, encouraging their participation in both sports and cultural activities. NCC, NSS and personality development activities. All the campuses have playgrounds for various games, indoor sports complex with gymnasium facilities to keep the students physically fit, mentally alert, morally sound and socially responsible. Chenu Khaburlu, a first of its kind student-run radio program in the country for farmers, is testimony to the civil engagement. The undergraduate students of all faculties are made real world ready through unique programs. A rural agricultural work experience program in the villages. In-plant training in agro-industries and AELP for agripreneurship skills in the final year, fostering the Make in India spirit. The diverse student community is provided comfortable campus residential accommodation, Wi-Fi facilities along with nutritious food, creating a home away from home on the lush green campus. Research To elevate the social economic status of the Telangana farmers through doubling their income, the research wing constantly strives to deliver innovative, sustainable and affordable agri-technologies. All the three regional agricultural research stations and 12 research stations in the state are constantly making efforts to provide technical inputs to resolve the location-specific farming issues. Several varieties of rice, maize, green gram, black gram, red gram, castor, sesame released by the university have gained popularity both in the state and country for their high yield and quality. Rice blast resistant paddy variety Krishna and scented rice variety Suganda Samba, Shobini, Sumati, high yielding Telangana Sona, Kunaram Sannalu, Batukamma, Jaktial Sannalu, Varangal Samba, the maize hybrids DHM 117 and DHM 121, the hybrid caster PCH 111 and PCH 222. Also, red gram variety PRG176, green gram variety WGG42 have found their way into the seed chain under the brand Telangana Seeds. The Seed Research and Technology Center of PJTSAU have exclusive agreements with seed agencies to breed the seeds developed by it and in turn supplies the developed seed to the farmers. Agroclimate Research Center collaborates with national and international research agencies constantly monitoring the local situation, providing timely weather forecasts, agro-advisories and contingency plans to ride over the crisis of climate aberrations. In tune with the state priorities towards producing more crops per drop of water, the university continues to develop and promote water conserving practices such as zero tillage maize in paddy fields, drip irrigation and fertigation in major field and vegetable crops, drum seeding and direct seeding, alternate wetting and drying technology in rice, and farm pond technologies to make dry land agriculture profitable. Recognizing the need for resource-based sustainable agriculture, PJTSAU has taken the lead in developing soil fertility status maps of the entire state to delineate crop colonies for promoting demand-driven farming. Greater impetus is being given to promote seed-to-seed -seed mechanization to reduce the input cost and overcome labor shortage. 
integrated pest management and vertebrae pest management practices promoted by the university are helping farmers reduce costs and environmental pollution. Complementing the field research, the university prides itself in possessing state-of-the-art laboratories such as Institute of Biotechnology for Molecular Research, Biological Control Laboratory, a nodal agency for state biocontrol labs, and NABL accredited laboratories. Pesticide Residue Laboratory for promoting safe pesticide use and Quality Control Laboratory for food safety analysis. Home Science Farm family being the central focus of PJT SAU, the Community Sciences faculty is striving to develop drudgery reduction technologies for farm women. Improving the nutritional status of women and children in rural communities and training rural women in value-added enterprises. The Millet Incubation Center is one such initiating for developing entrepreneurial skills of rural women in helping them set up low-cost agro-based industries to empower rural women by making them economically self-reliant. The Eco Color Center established to produce and promote natural dyes is an example of the university's commitment to environmental conservation. Extension The strong extension wing of the university bridges the gap between the technology generator and adopter through regular on-farm trials, field visits, kisan melas, training programs, exhibitions, and farmer scientist interaction programs. The DAT centers with a multidisciplinary team of scientists are the ambassadors of the university at the ground level, who directly lies with farmers and line department officials on real-time field problems. Farmers are being trained through KVKs in modern farming techniques and entrepreneurial skills in rural youth. To strengthen the untiring efforts of field-level functionaries and to reach the unreached farmers, PJTSAU fully harnesses the power of print and digital media through the AI and CC and electronic wing. The Extension Education Institute excels in capacity building in agricultural extension personnel of the six states and three union territories of India. Steadily and constantly striving for the welfare of the farmers and economic development of the state. Professor Jay Shankar Telangana State Agricultural University is committed to blossom into a world-class farm university and steering the agricultural sector out of crisis towards Bangaru Telangana. <laughs>